Okay, let's see how this goes. Hello, my friends. It's been a long winter, hasn't it? And yet I'm not entirely sure where it went. If I'm honest, I was barely there. What I'm about to tell you is a memory of a memory, like a dream I once had. I believe it happened, but all I can recall is the idea of the thing, a picture of the dream, misshapen by time and fog. It was long, long ago. The night of the winter solstice, the shortest day. By then, winter had already felt like forever. I had spent so long enveloped in darkness. I was very small. They took me outside to walk in the winter air. The ground was thick with mud and ice and my feet were so tiny. My shoes kept getting dragged down into the sticky mud. I distinctly recall my arms being pulled, each by a different grown-up, a splitting apart, that wild sensation of swinging. What would you have done, my friends? Would you have tiptoed lightly, barely touching dirt? Maybe you'd have just stayed home. Just as dusk was falling, we came to a forest. A thick, dense wood I'd never seen before. Suddenly walking felt much easier. I scrunched my way through the snapping twigs and fallen leaves, inhaling cold winter air. I can almost taste it, that delicate blend of damp floor and evergreen. But those dark, dark woods, the sense of alone. I could almost have been overcome by fear, my friends, but we made our next discovery. A den, a stack of logs carefully balanced into a hidden cave, exactly my size. I squeezed myself in, a perfect fit. It was made for me. From my hidey hole, I watched the last slithers of winter sky sneak softly through this unnatural arrangement of wood. I felt safe in my den. Like, no matter how strange and dark it gets in this deep, dense forest, Others have passed before us. Bodies like mine leaving marks, an initial carved into wood or piles of sticks and elaborate compositions. It felt like I was protected. It felt like you are not alone. My friends, I've seen you look for this too, checking the sticks I bring home for you for the marks of others, the mouths who held them, an indent of teeth, the stranger who rubbed their muzzle against the tip. I present my sticks to you as an offering. You are not alone. By the time I came out of my den, it was well and truly dark. 
One moment my hideaway had been filled with magic, moon peeping between the trees. The next I was screaming, I want to go home. That is winter. The shortest day. I don't know if you need to feel all of it, my friends. The enveloping darkness, that bone cold ache, the sense that you might never be warm again. But winter is all about contrast. It's bright white mornings. The way smell clings in your throat like ice. Your breath becomes visible. Fleeting moments of heatless sun eclipsed almost instantly by long, dark nights. To know winter is just to survive this harshness. To find a den of your own, a place where you fit. Or better yet, to fill the darkness with marks of the creatures who love you. With warmth and smell and light. To let time pass around you. This won't last forever, but I need you to make the best of it. Be still and fat and safe in your den. Fill dark days with light wherever you find it. Stay warm, little friends. This too shall pass.